Okay, I'm going to show you how to capture your images. You need to identify your area of interest. Once you identify the area of your interest by navigating on your sample, you can start increasing your magnification. Then in order to have better focus on your sample, instead of doing it on a whole window, you can double click here and make the window smaller and then using the fine knob try to find your focus point so I'm trying to focus on the sound in the meantime I need to make sure the astigmatism is not there and then adjust it by the astigmatism knob a little bit of astigmatism is there, but it's not important in this case. Let's go around 200. Change the speed to slow 5 by double click here. Slow 5. And now push the M button. This will capture your image. You can digitally enhance it by going to PCI software and then save it. Or you can save it directly by selecting it here and save it from here. Any of these moods, you can select it and take your image on that mood. Either secondary Z contrast or TE works the same. You find your area of interest, use the reduced area, focus on your sample, slow five, and push the M button. First image is here. I can select it here and directly save it here, or just select it here, push the PCI button. It will open in PCI, process, histogram, push auto. You can digitally enhance the quality of your image. Okay, and then from here you can save as or export your image to your folder. Remember, all the images for this microscope on our drive TEM drive D, make a folder with your name and save your images from here. The users are not allowed to use their flash drive on this microscope. They can retract their data from the, the computer out there with the sign TEM and SEM images. 